Hello, welcome to the video. Today I would like to show you something that I use when I go hiking and camping. This is really convenient, it's really affordable and it's really quick and easy to do. So if you're someone that likes to go hiking, especially if you like to go on multi-day trails or walking the Camino de Santiago for example, I think you're gonna find this interesting. Keep watching. So when I go hiking, I like to have everything accessible, meaning that I like to have places where I can put my phone, my car keys, my camera, my lip balm, my sunscreen. And that's why I started to use a bun bag about two years ago. Now the bun bag was very, very convenient. However, it started to bother me because when I was going uphill, for example, or scrambling on a piece of trail, I often felt like the bum bag was getting in the way and it certainly felt a little bit uncomfortable around the midsection. So I began looking for a chest bag instead. The thing is, what I found was that chest bags are not all that common, number one. And number two, chest bags, when you find them, they tend to be very expensive. Certainly the ones that I was looking at. I purchased a bum bag and I transformed this bum bag into a chest bag, which is really easy to do. I need to learn how to dress myself properly. You just put the bum bag on as normal around the waist area. Once you have it here, you loosen the strap so that it's way too big for you. And then it's easy to shimmy the bag up to the chest area. At this stage, the strap will just be comfortably flat to your back. Not tight, but just flat to your back. And you don't need this strap to be tight on the bum bag itself because we're gonna hold it in place using the cross strap on the bag. So when the bum bag is up here in the chest area, you take this cross strap, you loop it underneath the bum bag on both sides, and then you clip it together. And that's it, voila, you have a chest bag, which was once a bum bag. Cool. Now, of course, you can do this with absolutely any bun bag, but I did spend quite a bit of time trying to pick one out that was the right size for what I wanted, that looked comfortable, that looked a high enough quality, and it looked like it would be some way resistant to the rain or the weather here in Ireland. And that's when I came across this bag here. It's by a company called Waterfly. The straps are also quite wide, which does matter with a bag like this because if the strap is too thin, it's gonna eventually start cutting into you as you walk. That doesn't happen with this bag. The zips on it are solid, the material is thick, and the pockets for what I want it for, which is my phone, my camera, my lip balm, are just about the right size. I put a link to this exact bum bag in my bio and on the Camp Fairy website. So make sure you click on that exact link to make sure that you're looking at the very same bag as in this video. I really like this bag by Waterfly, but the system itself is something that you can obviously try out with any bag that you have lying around at home. And what have you got to lose by giving it a try anyway, right? So that's my video. I hope you found it useful or entertaining in some way. Thank you for watching. It would really help out my channel if you could hit the like button on this video. And also, if you'd like to see more of these videos, make sure to hit the subscribe button too. So that's all for now. We'll be seeing each other again really soon. See you later.